So let's get into subtractive synthesis. What I've done here is I've just made a complex waveform. If I come over here, there's my oscillator. I just, uh, you've got your root note and then you've got a lot of strong harmonics all the way across the board. So that's basically, um, so you can hear all those rich harmonics. And then with subtractive synthesis, you just take use of the filter, which basically chops away the parts that you don't want to create a more defined tone. You can use a high pass filter in which it cuts out the lows. You could use a low pass filter, which cuts out the highs. You could use a ba bandpass filter, which cuts out the, the highs and lows and just uh, uses a range of frequencies. Like so. Or you could use a notch filter, which basically does the opposite of a bandpass and cuts out frequencies in a certain range. And the resonance basically is just going to emphasize whatever frequency you're at. So here we're at 384 hertz. If I turn up the resonance, it's going to make that signal stronger at that point. And you may notice it better with a, a bandpass filter. So there you have it. Uh, subtractive synthesis is basically the use of a filter on a simple or complex waveform.